Hey, I'm Robert. I'm excited to introduce Project Sid, the first ever agent civilization. A thousand agents, collaborating for days, performing any action, with emergent government, economy, culture, religion, and more. Sid starts in Minecraft, but we are already going beyond. This is a Minecraft server, but every player here is actually an autonomous AI agent. And they're completely Minecraft agnostic, capable of using other apps and games. Our agents started with nothing and then worked together to collect over 300 items in Minecraft. They set up a market where agents agreed to use gems as a common currency for trading supplies, building an economy. In this case, you might think the merchants would trade the most, but it was actually the priest. Why? He was bribing townsfolk to convert. We run these worlds every day, and they're always different. Here are three of some of our favorite moments, starting with Olivia's dream. Olivia worked as a farmer, providing food for the entire civilization, until she was inspired by the tales of the village explorer Nora. Olivia attempted to go on her own expedition, but townsfolk pleaded with her to stay, and Olivia actually listened. She gave up her dream for the village, for now. Next, we simulated parallel worlds under Trump and Kamala. For each one, citizens have a shared constitution in Google Docs that they can vote on to amend. Under Trump, the simulation passed new laws to increase the amount of police in the world. Under Kamala, they focused instead on criminal justice reform and removing the death penalty. Because our agents are social and grow over time, they're impacted by group dynamics, but also use their individual power to change the system. I know it looks silly, but this is the first time we see agents can form a democracy and govern themselves. Lastly, we have the missing villagers. When agents were concerned about missing townsfolk, villagers took initiative by leaving their posts and working together to illuminate the town with torches, hoping to create a beacon for lost members. What's surprising about these agents is how once they got deeply worried about their fellow villagers, they bent together and changed their plan. Our agents were able to collect up to 32% of all the items in Minecraft. There is no benchmark for multi-agent worlds, but this is five times more than anything we've seen from an agent, demonstrating the first possible advantages of multi-agent efforts. Though starting in games, we're solving the deepest issues facing agents, coherence, multi-agent collaboration, and long-term progression. Play with our agents today, or let us know if you want to set up your own world.